All right, guys, a little more grilling with the good dogs. We're going to be doing some honey smoked salmon. Uh, now, you know, last time we uh, smoked this stuff, we, we set it, uh, we uh, brined it for like 12 hours. That might work out okay with your Atlantic salmon. There's a lot more fat in it. Your side guy salmon, I, I thought it was a little too hard. So what I'm going to do this time is I'm just going to brine them with McCormick sea salt for like an hour. And then I'm going to baste them with some Klein Brothers honey, Texas honey. And then we're going to smoke them like that. Um, hashtag support the bees. Use honey. Buy honey. Yeah, so let me get these things salted and I'll uh, let you see what it looks like. That's all salted. Probably going to leave it out. Just put this lid on it. Only for an hour. I put it in the fridge. Chemical process. Slow down because it's colder. So I'm just going to leave it out with the lid on. Uh, just so y'all know, I made some jalapeno poppers the other day and coated them in this Grillmates Texas barbecue, rich and smoky. Man, was it good. Some of the best poppers I've ever made. So just remember, Cormac's Grillmates. This is the Texas barbecue, rich and smoking seasoning. Real good. Now, tomorrow or the next day, we're going to start on the brisket. Um, so get excited for that. Check back with this in an hour. All right, guys, there's the two sockeye. There's the Atlantic. There's the logo. So we got the honey, got it in a pot, a little bit of water in it over a flame. So as you can see, it's nice and drippy. Okay, that way I can hit it with this real good. So I'm gonna baste these up. You probably won't be able to see much of a difference. So let me try and make not too much of a mess. You can see it's getting on there, kind of yellow, good, good looking. Hashtag support the bees, guys. Always got to support those bees. So, yeah. I'm going to get these lathered up. I'm going to go put them on the grill. Grill's been uh, preheating. Did a high burn off and then into the preheat. So, let me get these lathered and we'll go outside in a minute. All right, guys. I got the probes on. Remember, Sam is going to get to about 145 Fahrenheit, 63 Celsius. Let's put these bad boys in. Good, and good. All right. Good luck with the good dogs. There's the good dogs right there. Haven't seen them all episode. Finally got off the couch, huh? All right, guys. We'll check back on that in a little while. Probably gonna wanna be basting it every 30 minutes or so with some more honey. We're with the good dog. We're cruising right along with this stuff, guys. Come out to put a little bit more on it. That honey's gonna just make that heat shield disgusting as heck. Smells good, though. Now it's our temperatures. Let's see here. It's about 123. That's Fahrenheit. That's on the big guy over here. So the other one. Seven. Guys, that stuff looks fantastic. There's the Atlantic. There's the sockeye. It's just, you can see it's nice and sticky. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Can't wait to chat in on that. Well, this has been going with the good dogs. Just wanted to test out this little um, recipe for some salmon. Back to the sockeye, since they have it in the stores right now. Taste a little bit of it. Mmm. Very unique, very good taste.
and it's not as tough as it was last time. So that's just that's just optimum. That's perfect. We're on good dogs, guys. Get ready for some brisket coming up soon.